And next up is a hidden interaction with Mage Hand. This summon can actually equip certain weapons. This can be very helpful if you need Falara Luve's Shriek and don't want to have one of your characters carrying it. Just have the Mage Hand provided. You can also have it give buffs, like the Sword of Justice. Just have it cast Shield of Faith on you for plus two AC, and then leave it behind and keep the bonus AC until long rest. The Mage Hand has a ton of cool equipment it can use, and it might be more helpful than you might think. Just be careful, if the Mage Hand dies with the equipment, that equipment will be lost forever. That's why you'll need to make sure that you use the Arcane Trickster Mage Hand, Legerdemain, because it lasts forever, you just need to keep it safe. You can have Falara Luve's Shriek and Sanctuary on at the same time, but remember that Sanctuary doesn't make it invulnerable just so that it can't be targeted, so it could still die. 